Hi guys, you may have noticed my voice is slightly different. That's because for various reasons I'm unable to use my actual voice, so I'm using AI instead. In my last video I showed you guys the process of how I made an AI cover generation pipeline for my freelance job at an AI waifu startup. Since then, I have made several improvements to the code such as adding a simple web UI for users to generate AI song covers with a few button presses. You can also run this within a Google Colab notebook, if you do not own a powerful enough NVIDIA GPU. The main goal of this program is to provide users with a quick and easy way to generate AI song covers of their favorite characters and voices, without going through the hassle of learning how to use Ultimate Vocal Remover, Retrieval-based voice conversion, and other audio production software, since the code has integrated most of their important functionalities into a single application. Now let's first start with the local setup, which you should only perform if you have an NVIDIA GPU. If not, please skip ahead to the Colab section using the timestamps in the video. You will need to have Git and Python installed, preferably Python 3.9 as other versions like 3.11 have several dependency conflicts, and you can do so by following the instructions in these links that I have provided in the README document of my repository. You will also need to install FFmpeg as well, which will require the additional step of adding the path of the FFmpeg folder to your path environment variable for Windows. Simply follow the steps in the guide and you'll be fine. Next copy and paste these commands into a command line window at a directory of your choice and run them. After this is done, do the same for the command under download required models. Now you can copy the run web UI command and run it. Once the local URL appears, click on it and a new tab to the web UI will appear. Now to address the folks at home who want to use the Google Colab method, click on the Open in Colab badge, which should open a new tab in your browser. All you have to do is click Run Time and Run All, wait for a few minutes, and a public radio URL should appear, where you will be directed to the web UI page. Before we start generating our AI covers, we must first download the RVC voice model. Click on the Download tab, where you can download any model by providing a download link to a zip, containing the model file and an optional index file. These links can be easily found on the AI Hub Discord server under the Voice Model section, where you can search for your favorite characters and copy the Hugging Face download link. Once you have copied a link, paste it into the web UI. Give it a suitable unique name and click Download. This will take a few seconds before showing a success message. To finally start generating an AI cover, navigate to the Generate tab, select your voice model from the drop-down list. You may have to click on Update if your newly downloaded model is not here. Paste a link to any song on YouTube and click Generate. In less than a few minutes, the AI cover should be generated and ready for download. i 
こでしょどこよりもどこよりも誰も彼も私を見てよ体育館のドアあなたにここはそう嘘みたいでしょあなたが好きなの汚いあの子が愛して愛して愛して全部あげるあなたにあなたに全部しょってもらうよ足りないあなたが足りない離さないよこうねうるさい愛して愛して愛してもっともっと愛して愛して If you want to hear more examples of the generated covers, you may check out my previous video. Of course, these generations may not always be perfect, depending on how well the vocals are separated from the instrumentals, or the quality of the dataset that the original RVC voice model was trained on. In my experience, using RVC models trained on singing datasets will definitely sound better than those trained on talking datasets. This repository will constantly be updated with new fixes or changes, and is also welcome to any pull requests for new features that you may want to add. Maybe adding support for music from Spotify or other sites other than YouTube, or functionality to control the volume of instrumentals and vocals. Do take note that any new pull requests should not drastically increase the complexity of the web UI, or that will defeat the purpose of an easy-to-use AI cover generator. Well, that's all from me, and remember to have fun listening to your beloved characters sing your favorite songs.